Brotherhood of the Eternal Light, teaching the Western Mysteries. The Sephirot on the Tree of Life. Chochmah. This video is part of our free online course on Kabbalah and the Western Mysteries. The link to the course can be found in the description of this video. From Keta, the first Sephirah, where everything is still inseparably linked, Chochmah, the second Sephirah, emanates. Chokhmah means wisdom because in Chokhmah the will of God manifests as the divine plan. Chokhmah is the divine principle of fatherly creative power. The number two corresponds to a line that comes out of a point and thus connects two points, just as the first soul sparks appear out of the unity of Keter. Thus Chochmah embodies the creative will of God. The divine name of Chochmah is Yah. This is a short form of the Tetragrammaton. The Archangel of Chochmah is Ratziel, the will of God, or also Raziel, mystery of God. The angels of Chochmah are the Ofanim, the wheels. The emanation of Chochmah out of Keter is the emanation of a line from a point. For this reason the magical wand is also a symbol of Chochmah. In the spiritual work, the wand stands for the will of the mystery student which is focused onto one point with dedication and in accordance with the higher will. Another symbol of Chochmah is the bright pillar called Yachin, the upright. Yachin, the right pillar in front of the Temple of Solomon, corresponds to the right pillar of the Tree of Life, which is called the Pillar of Mercy. The Sephirot Chachmah, Hesed and Natzach from the right pillar on the Tree of Life. The Pillar of Mercy represents the creative and constructive powers of the universe. The allegorical representation of Chachmah is an elderly bearded man this is a symbolic representation of the active creative principle of wisdom. Another level of meaning corresponding to Chachmah is the positive active male spiritual principle. The planet Neptune is assigned to Chachmah. Neptune indicates how and in which area of life we see visions and transcend the earthly world. Traditionally, the Masalot, which is the Hebrew word for the twelve signs of the zodiac, are assigned to Chochmah. In the human body, the left brain hemisphere is assigned to Chochmah. The soul level of Chochmah is called Haya, which means soul spark. To Chochmah, we assign the four twos of the tarot. The twos of the tarot represent the pure principle of each element and stand for the first manifestation of each element from the Divine Source. The four knights of the Tarot's court cards also belong to Chochmah. The virtues of Chochmah are devotion and unreserved dedication. There are no vices assigned to Chochmah. The spiritual experience of Chochmah is the sight of God face to face. Through this experience, the mystery student gets an insight into a part of creation and the divine will. Now, you might like to take a look at the following video in this series, which is part 3, Bina.